Welcome to the Immuna Project, where it doesn't matter what background you have, what religion you are, it only matters that you're seeking the truth like the rest of us. Guys, I just want to tell you that you are super duper unique. I, I was reminded of some things that I, I need to think about for myself and I need to share with others. And I for sure need to tell my kids and my wife. There's about seven things that I found in this uh, beautiful little book called The Path to Your Peak. And he says, look, you're super duper unique. Like God created you just like he created you with uh, unique fingerprints. Your fingerprints are not like anybody else's fingerprints on the entire planet. So too, everything about you is completely unique. And there's... There's no exception to that. Um, every person, you're not like anyone else. And you've got a really special job to do as you, as the unique you. And he's given you like specific attributes, specific skills. And if you don't know what those are, then obviously you've got to find them, identify them. And But certainly they do exist and you have a special job to do and when you find out what those special skills are you have more confidence in what that job is since he's given you those special tools obviously you have a mission that is supposed to be accomplished and the really neat thing is is that the creator is giving you that mission and you can do it <laughs> right so a beaver has his mission. He builds a dam. Uh, a clam produces a pearl. Like they have different missions. They're not like jealous of each other, but they have their thing and they're able to accomplish it. So to you have a special thing and you are able to accomplish that. Fourthly, God absolutely loves you. <laughs> it's a big one. Like I was speaking to Hashem in my personal prayer and I was asking him to talk to me and he said in a very, very soft voice, I love you. And it's so important that we hear that. It's so important that we know that the Creator loves us. He's our Father. And yes, he's got many children, but there is no child like you. <laughs> like you're unique. You are created to be in his image and he's a loving father he's always doing what is best for you because he absolutely loves you so that should give you the confidence to believe in yourself you have a lot of worth there is a priceless priceless tiny spark of the divine light inside of you and if you would continue to dig to your soul, to the true you, then you'll truly find the apparent worth of that spark and how special that is and how priceless you are. All of us have the ability to improve. I remember asking some people like, do I have it? Do I have the capacity to go above where I am. Some people are like, I don't know if you do or not. <laughs> but I want to tell you that you do. Like, you have the potential to become what the Creator has asked for you to do and has that mission for you. So, character strengthening, refinement of your traits, all that stuff is part of your mission to refine yourself. And if the Creator gives us a job to do, of course He's going to give us the power to succeed at doing that job. So don't worry about whether or not you have what it takes. And then the seventh thing was, you can be happy. <laughs> my happiness is not contingent upon reaching my peak. Okay? Like, you can be happy right now. And... The happier you are, well, the greater the chances that you're actually going to reach that peak because you've got the joy inside of your life and you've got happiness and you're not complaining. Thank God. Guys, those are seven things I would um, try my best to 
renew that in my mind every day until they are so ingrained that I can't forget them. And I'm going to endeavor to share that exact thing with my wife and with my kids that I tell them over and over and over, you are unique. You have a special job to do. You can accomplish your mission on earth. The creator loves you. I am a person of worth. I have the power to improve myself and I can be happy. Have a great weekend.